city rushes in crying. She rolls herself on the ground, screaming and crying. Lakole was confused. He didn't understand what was happening. He asked her if she was beaten by the ballet. Sidi, with tears in her eyes, said she was deceived by the lion. That the lion wasn't infertile. He raped her and took away her virginity. She felt betrayed. Lakole wasn't pleased. But he told her that it didn't matter and he was ready to marry her anyway. Sidi was confused and she couldn't believe that he would do such a thing for her. She turned to him and asked if he was sure and he said yes. But immediately when the marriage preparation started, Lakole became very unhappy. He said he needed more time. Sidi wasn't surprised. She laughed and she said she's actually getting ready to marry Batle because it is the only thing she can do now. Sadiku blesses her and asks the gods for fertility. The wedding ceremony began and even Lakunle seems to be enjoying it when a young woman chased around him, shook her butts at him. And that brings us to the end of this particular class. See you in the next class.